Hello guys, welcome to Mercedes-Benz King. This is the all new facelift Mercedes E-Class, the E63S sedan with an amazing spec. In this video, I will show you the complete exterior, interior, all the new technology changes because it has the newest MBUX with the navigation system and augmented reality. So it shows you the directions with a camera in front. And you will also experience the AMG performance of this E63S with its V8 Biturbo 4 Matic Plus because the sound is phenomenal. Very fast and smooth. And before we do that, let's have a look at the design changes of this facelift E-Gloss. Especially noticeable are these new flat headlights, similar to the S-Class design. So it has two dots characterizing the E-Class and the S-Class has three dots. And you can also see the same characteristic design language in the interior because it has the newest generation steering wheel. In the front you can also notice the Panamericana grille, new for the E63, which makes it a full-on AMG. And it has lovely bumpers blacked out because this particular E63S has the night package. And the grille is now in an A shape, so not upward. And it has carbon fiber details here in the lower part of the front diffuser. Furthermore, you can see it has a jet-like design for the front bumpers. And make sure guys that you follow me on Instagram, the link is down below. And I have amazing content special for you about all new Mercedes models. And moving over into the side, you can notice that this new front blends beautiful into the wheel archers. And this is also the characteristics of the E63S. It is very forward moving, especially the front part with the white wheel archers. And it also has the new AMG rims with a matte color design and the carbon ceramic brakes golden. The size is 265 35 ZR20 inch. And it also has the V8 Biturbo Formatic Plus emblem on the side with the carbon details around it for the carbon package. Same goes for the side mirror cap and blacked out contours around the window. And the E-Class characteristics continue here in the rear side because it has this horizontal line moving from the front all the way to the rear, connecting here at the rear side. And here you can notice the new design of the tail lights. It is now in two parts and focusing more on the width with its horizontal design. It has the AMG emblem on the left side, the E63S lettering on the right side and the carbon fiber spoiler very small but it emphasizes the aggressiveness of this E63S and I love these new E63S exhaust tips of AMG it has these scratches on the top man-made and this is because it is the S model without the S you don't have these lines on the top of the exhaust tips again a lot of carbon fiber details on the diffuser here in the rear so let's have a look at what is in the trunk And this is also why the E-Class is very known for. It is very practical. Around 600 liters of trunk capacity. It has the keyless entry. So if you put your hand on it, the car will lock and unlock. And as you open the door, you can immediately notice the new steering wheel, the yellow contrast stitching on the door side. So let's go inside. And I will close the door and there you can see the Mercedes E63S AMG front with a welcome screen. So I've got the key right here, AMG lettering in the front and an Affaltenbach AMG emblem on the back side. So I will just leave it at the storage compartment with two cup holders, gorgeous carbon fiber center console. And I will press the button for the electronics to work. And what you immediately can notice is this navigation screen with the augmented reality camera giving directions for which way to turn. You can change the volume with this capacitive button on the steering wheel. Up. And you can decrease it. 
it is very intuitive you don't have to press any buttons and the steering wheel also learns from your way of swiping and this of course is the new AMG steering wheel it has a gorgeous mixture of leather and Alcantara with a gorgeous contrast yellow stitching all around the interior and I love the new design which we can also see in the new S-Class a large Mercedes star in the center and an AMG emblem on the flat bottom steering wheel design furthermore around the interior beautiful lines and curves as we are used to of the E-Class but the main difference is here in the technology it now has the new MBUX so you can say hey Mercedes how can I help? what is the temperature today? today it will be partly cloudy in Ruland with temperatures between 12 and 23 degrees awesome so it connects with your phone or with the internet in the car and it is very smooth it also has the head-up display in front of the driver's seat here you can change it with pressing the home button and if you swipe up you can change these settings so you can combine it with the navigation system but also have a full AMG experience until 8000 rpm there are two separate parts on the steering wheel the left part is to control the infotainment system in front of you and with the right part you can control the screen in the center console it is also a touch screen so you can press the home button and just swipe through the settings to for example the vehicle settings and here you have your quick access but let's go back to navigation you can also control this here with the home button and just swipe through the settings for example when you're driving you don't want to lean all the way forward with your hand and with the new S class this of course has changed because the screen is a lot larger and also closer to the driver so let me know guys in the comment section below do you like this MBUX style or the new S class with this large screen in the center it has the seat adjustments with gorgeous carbon fiber door trim and the Burmester surround sound system you can change the seats in many different ways and you can't change the headrest because these are the AMG Sport Cup seats very sportive but also comfortable in some way some storage space with two USB-C connectivity slots and as you have noticed this steering wheel has the AMG performance buttons so you can change the characteristics of this vehicle on the left side you can change the suspension from comfort all the way to sport plus for a very stiff ride and you can also change the exhaust button to drive comfortable but with the exhaust mode on but you can also just go for full sport plus and in this way the steering is very sharp suspension very stiff but we will see that in the driving minutes so now it is time to have a listen to the sound of this new facelift E63S the last video was a pre-production so this one is the final edition which people actually can buy so let's start it up I will press the upshift because this is the emotion start of AMG you can also use the downshift and at the same time start the engine then it starts with a little rumble let's listen there is also of course the race mode It has a lot of pops and bangs as you could hear and it still is from the regulation so everything is fine before we take it for a drive let's have a look at what is under the bonnet you can also order it with soft closing doors of course so let's have a look and here it is a V8 bi-turbo producing over 612 horsepower 
850 newton meters of torque. So from 0 to 100 kilometers an hour just in 3.2 seconds. And from 0 to 200 kilometers an hour in less than 9 seconds, can you imagine? The top speed is well over 300 kilometers an hour with the performance package that this one has. So let's take it for a drive. Lovely Mercedes star with a welcome screen. So let me press the button and I will just buckle up. Let's decrease the volume. And I will start the engine by pressing the downshift for the emotion start. So I will put it into drive with the gear selector behind the steering wheel. And in this way you have a lot of free space here at the sensory console. And let's go. We start in the comfort mode. And Mercedes-Benz with Mercedes-AMG really emphasized on the difference of the comfort mode and the Sport Plus. Because now the difference is huge. In comfort that feels like a cruiser, you can really have long distance trips and enjoy the luxury in the interior with this new generation steering wheel, just like the new S-Class. And as you can hear, it has the navigation system active. And in this way, it is combined with the augmented reality. So it tells you exactly with the camera where you need to take a turn especially at crossings left. and traffic lights, it is very handy. The new S-Class will have it in the heads-up display. So can you imagine you're just looking on the road and you will see arrows pointing to the left and right. In 300 meters, the traffic light. Aggressive. And this steering wheel is new, it feels so thick in your hands. I love the Alcantara on the sides. Lovely crackles.
we are driving on the German autobahns and as you can see from this sign right here, traffic sign, there is no speed limit. You can also change the display in front of you. So if you press the home button, you can swipe to the right to still in display. Currently it is on the Super Sport. But let's select the classic. And in this way you have your speedometer on the left side, a digital speedometer in the center, and on the right side the RPM, which you can also change. And as we saw from the S-Class, they changed the many different ways that you can configure the screen. The engine data with, with your engine output and engine torque. But I will leave it on the vehicle and now you can see the G-Force. Swipe down and now you have a full screen navigation in front of you. If you swipe to the left or right you will zoom in and out. Very responsive. This is a 9 speed automatic transmission. AMG speed shift downshift very fast and smooth now this is the ninth gear I will go back to the comfort mode and then you can really cruise on the autobahn you don't notice the bumps So guys, I hope you liked this video and thanks for watching Merch Benz King. I hope to see you guys next time and stay tuned for the GT Black series coming up soon. Bye bye.